we are talking about synthetic fibers we already discussed rayon nylon and polyester now the fourth one is acrylic fibers nowadays we are using lot of materials which resemble wool we know that wool is extracted from animals like sheep yak etc since it is obtained from animal it is highly costly and we know that it is it will not be sufficient for our requirement so in order to make our uh, need sufficient or in order to make more and more uh, wool like material we synthesized a fiber called acrylic fiber which resemble wool which we are using instead of wool materials now what are the peculiarity of this acrylic fiber this acrylic fibers are relatively cheap it is not costly like original wool this acrylic materials available in variety of colors and it is commonly used now for making sweaters shawls blankets etc sweaters shawls blankets etc are prepared by using acrylic fiber and it is available a lot with cheap price so we can conclude that acrylic fibers resemble wool but it is cheap it is available in variety of colors and it is commonly used for making sweaters shawl blanket etc now we can see what are the characteristic features of these synthetic fibers till now we discussed what are synthetic fibers how it is prepared what are its important uses now we are going to see what are the general characteristics of the synthetic fibers it will dry up quickly i already told you the synthetic fibers will not absorb more water when we compare it with natural fibers as a result of that it will get dry up quickly second point it is more durable we know that it is very difficult for us to store and uh, protect the original silk materials it will become damaged after some years if you are not keeping it properly but this type of material will not get any harm or it will not damage even though we are keeping it for a long time it is more durable it is less expensive it need only less cost it is affordable one everyone can collect it it is readily available it is very easy to maintain and also it is dyed in different colors nowadays when we are going to textiles we are able to see variety of dress materials in variety of colors it is made by dyeing so when we are making synthetic fibers we are able to make it in variety of colors 
Now, what is the disadvantages of the synthetic fibers? Synthetic fibers melt on heating. In class 6, you studied what will happen if you burn natural fiber and synthetic fiber. We studied that natural fiber when burned, it will be having the smell of hair and it will burn when we are burning. But the synthetic fibers melt on heating. Therefore, if we are making dress material out of the synthetic fiber and if accidentally it get burned, it will melt and it will stick to our body and it will cause disastrous effects, dangerous effects. That is the reason why the people who get burned is having severe wound if they wear this synthetic fiber mattress materials. So it is not good to wear synthetic dress material, synthetic fiber dress materials inside the kitchen. Now the last topic of synthetic fibers. We are making synthetic fibers by using raw materials of petroleum origin which we call by a single term that is petrochemicals. So what are petrochemicals? Synthetic fibers are prepared by a number of processes using raw materials of petroleum origin. The raw materials of petroleum origin we call by a term petrochemicals. By this we can say that we concluded this section synthetic fibers.